A warm welcome uh, to our Leaders Exchange session co-hosted by Bridge Labs. Um, I'm Avinash, uh, one of the founders of Global Talent Exchange. Um, a great uh, workplace disruption has happened and we're still kind of figuring out the new normal. Um, navigating the talent market and, um, you know, changing scenario has uh, its own challenges. Um, the great attrition persists, employer-employee dynamics appear to be changing, uh, and quitting is up, um, but at the same time, are the wages, you know, rising, right? Um, there's a whooping, 63% uh, companies in India reporting shortage of talent, mainly uh, in the IT, engineering, emerging, uh, you know, areas. Things that uh, resonate with me, and at least things that I've observed change from a mindset perspective is, uh, a constant need and desire to innovate because uh, what's worked in the past obviously doesn't work anymore. Uh, so constant innovation uh, and I think pivoting a little towards uh, uh, your strategy in terms of build versus buy uh, because buy obviously is is not the only viable strategy these days given, given the war for talent. So how can you build talent internally? The whole fight is for predictable supply of talent. I saw it as an opportunity to kind of raise the bar on how we recruit. How do I look at talent which is ready and deployable? We need to look at graduates and you know, they need to be a big part of our uh, hiring strategy. That's what exactly Bridge Lab is. It started uh, with the core ethos that uh, you know how can we give 100% placement to all job seekers, right? and 100% job readiness to all tech companies. So if you ask yourself, all your team, are you hiring for budget or are you hiring for forecast? The answer is actually no, don't, none of us actually know. This is a crisis. I think the revenue generating roles are really commanding the premium. And that this generation wants a lot of choices. Uh, they, they want shorter career paths and they want recognition. They want to work with global talent across teams. They want to work with many things at the same time. I mean, there's, this, there's a mention that by 2025, people will spend about two hours in the metaverse. People will make money uh, in the non-fungible token environment. Uh, so, which means that basically doing a quick course on software develops, uh, uh, salesforce.com, etc. Some initial skills uh, can can provide some short-term success. Technology has brought the solutions. Uh, to these you know, problems that uh, exist. Uh, you know, for them to be there where they actually become thorough, uh, well-bred professionals. So that is the first responsibility I feel as professionals we should take.